Oh, che hai da fare? Non voglio farti perdere tempo. Che aspetti, no? Mi avevano detto che eravate in arrivo. Andiamo a bere qualcosa. Non me ne voglio, principe. Ma il viaggio è stato lungo. Non vedo l'ora di buttarmi a letto. Sai per rompere i coglioni e quelli che lavorano! Ma chi sei, dell'ispettorato? Guarda, è qua tutto in regola. Li conoscevi? E non sei dell'ispettorato. E sei la polizia. Bravo. Lo vedi che sei sveglio? Io i padroni non li conosco neanche. My name's Randall Paul, and this is Lorenzo Acquaviva. And we're at the studio, at Fossa's studio. And uh, it was nice having Lorenzo here. Uh, Thanks you for inviting me. <laughs> because we're always talking about acting, yeah. aren't we? You know, and the different processes. And, uh, <sighs> so, I mean, the big question, Randall, is uh, what is acting? <laughs> you, know, um, you know, for me, um, I've always said to my, my actors in, in America, you know, shut up and shoot, you know. We, <laughs> <laughs> okay, and, that's a good uh, point. <laughs> yeah, shut up. A good starting point. But, um, you know, uh, the point of acting for, for me, personally, mm. is try to not act. Yeah. You know, this is, this is, this is the important thing. But there are processes in order to arrive to that point yeah. because as you know a lot of actors feel that they have to act yeah well i always say acting is your job title it's not what you do um yeah you, good you, point you, you know what i mean and you know as you know the actors that i've worked with that you've worked with you've done a lot of work um you know for me personally those guys are able to transform themselves into what i call the temporary reality. Yeah. And this is what is needed to achieve, especially for film actors. Yeah. Because the camera doesn't lie. Yeah. You know. It's like a, a big microscope that goes into yourself. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, basically, you know, uh, we, we, we discussed a lot of times this, this question. Rando is not really for acting school. I mean, <laughs> I, I, I have to say that I am an actor that was trained a lot with the members of the actor studio, so with the Strasberg Stanislavski method. Yeah. But the real method is no method, in a way. Even Michael Margotta, one of my teachers, used to say, there are just tools when you don't have uh, the possibility to be inspired by something. Yeah, the tools, you know. Exactly. You know. And uh, basically, yeah, I'm, I'm very, very uh, close to what you think. I mean, uh, the thing is to bring life, to create life. You know, uh, uh, yeah, I, I, you know, on my website I always say you cannot be believable unless you believe. Yeah, and you cannot good point. Be, and you cannot be convincing unless you are convinced. convinced. You know, stop acting. Uh, at my studio, I'm very technical for the film actors. Yeah. And, you know, we do a lot of repetition, repetition. Um, because that's what we need to do as actors for film. Theater, which you have a lot more experience yeah. in than I do. I've only done one theater production in my life um, because I was always a commercial actor. Um, but uh, Well, yeah, theater is a good point. In the difference between theater and, and cinema. I think there is uh, just a difference with your transformation. Of course, on a stage, you have to come across to the audience with, uh, with more energy. We have uh, an audience, for instance, in Trieste, my city, we have a theater of 1,300 people. So can you imagine to do a slight movement in front of 1,300 people? They right. are not able to sit. So we have to have some energy maybe to, uh, uh, to uh, make it bigger, let's say. Well, this, yeah, this is, this is what we see here a lot at the studio, and certainly my studio in America. Um, when we've had theatrical actors come in, they're always very big. They're always very yeah. presentational or representational because theater is more of a, of a, 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 a linear medium. 
Yeah. You know, you have That's a, a beginning point. and you have the end. In film, we don't work this way. No. You know, I could. You, be, you start with the, the with the end, well, and then be, you go. I could be <laughs> shooting scene 23 one day, scene 46 the yeah. next, and then scene three the next. So there's nothing that's linear. And for the film actor, you know, they they're very aware of this. You know, and you have to be ready very very quickly. Yeah, you have to be ready very very quickly. And also, less is more. Yeah. You, you know, on film because you know when we're dealing with different lenses or different sound and lighting environments and things like that. You know, there's a lot of techniques to learn, and you know, here this is what we, this is what I pay attention to. You know, but on the other hand, uh, I'm very, uh, I'm very agree with what you were saying. But uh, on the other hand, even in theater, you have to create life. I mean, you don't have to fake. This is the key point: it's not faking, no acting, please. Yeah. It's just another kind of transformation, another kind of energy, another kind of way of uh, putting yourself to the audience. But you have to be real in theater as well as in camera. Oh yeah. You have to believe in what you're doing. You have to con to, to to have established relationship with your partner on stage. So it's just that you have to project. Yeah. Something, well, you know? see, this is the difference between theater, because in theater, you're actually working, and you said the good word, the relationship, you're actually working with somebody. Yeah. You know, sometimes in film, we're not working with anybody. We're working with the camera. So, I mean, there's been You have time, to make love with camera. Huh? Yeah, you know, there's <laughs> been times, you know, when I've worked with an actor, and that actor is actually in makeup. Yeah. You know, or has gone to the bathroom or whatever, you know, and you find yourself working with that actor who's actually not there. But that's a different discipline, mm -hmm. you know. So, whereas theater, you know, when I did my production in, whoa, what, 1981, 1982 for Medal of Honor Rag, you know, it was really an amazing experience. You know, we won the award for best play in Hollywood. Um, and it was fantastic, but it was a long time. It, it took a lot of my time. Um, but the energy was amazing, meeting the audience after the show, you know, this kind of thing. Um, you know, I, 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 it was amazing. I'd like to quote Marlon Brando on this thing. Marlon Brando used to say, Marlon Brando didn't like theater because the repetition, repetition <laughs> all the time, well, every night, here. <laughs> was, was really for him a pain in the ass. But He's saying a good, uh, a good metaphor. He was saying that cinema is masturbation <laughs> and theater is making love. That in a way I understand, I mean, yeah. I agree with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't really, <laughs> you don't get any satisfaction, really. When, you, when you're working in cinema, you don't really get that satisfaction. <laughs> Director says, okay, yeah, good job. Yeah, you know, that's it. And that's know. it. Yeah. And, then, and then you get the hell out and then, the, then they set up for everything else. But when you go to the cinema, then you see the result. Yeah, you know? yeah. Then, and then you know, but yeah, I can I can imagine. You know, uh, we do a lot of scene study here, and the students, uh, the, the actors. That's uh, very important. That's very uh, important too. And the actors really love it when they're doing the scene studies because they're they're working in front of the other actors. They're working out their parts. We're we're examining what 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 is going on. And and know? then you confront yourself because another. Key point, me and Randa, we are discussing a lot, that sometimes the actor's job is very alone. Very, yeah. you no, know, you are alone, oh, yeah. you are a lonely job. Yeah. It's very important to have a group of people uh, to confront yourself and uh, to, to, to work together, to establish yeah. a good working atmosphere, yeah. to learn to each other. I always say to my, my students that you learn a lot watching the other people who are working. This is yeah. a oh, yeah, very, yeah, very yeah. much uh, You know, it's also a, the important thing that I try to achieve here is also is an educated confidence. Yeah. You know, um, there, there's two types of confidences. There's the confidence that somebody is very willing, uh, you know, I want to be an actor, you know, I'm, mm -hmm. I, I'm very confident. The I, social yeah, way of and, being. You know, and, and then there's the confidence that you see in somebody because he knows what he's doing. Yeah. And there's two different, I always say that the other confidence kills. Yeah. You know, the, the educated confidence is really, once you... Uh, yeah. become, you know your job, you know yeah, what you're doing. You know, then it's a whole different thing. And other actors notice that a lot. You know, when you walk on set and you're working with a big actor or whatever, a very experienced actor, 
they 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 know that immediately. Did I hit my head? I wish you would stop doing that. Yeah. They know that immediately that you know what you're doing. And that really helps them as well. That, that's you know? another, you bring another point that it's very important to stress. That being an actor, uh, you have be, you, you have to study, uh, you know. It oh, yeah. seems that for being a dancer, for being a musician, you have to do academy and you have to work every day for <laughs> years and years. And to be an actor, you just wake up and you go there and you are an actor. No, an actor no, needs no. a lot, a lot, a lot of work. I studied, oh man. I'm actually <laughs> continue studying, yeah, you know? Yeah, <laughs> absolutely, yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, it's, it's yeah. never-ending job. Yeah. It's never-ending. You know, every time you receive a script, it's, it's another trip. It's, it's another journey. The only thing that you have is probably your discipline and your processes that, you know, especially with my script analysis here at the studio. Yeah, that's very important, you script know, analysis. We, we have a script analysis technique that we follow. And that's when the work begins. Yeah. You know, that's, that's the real work. And then you can start dealing with your character development. You can yeah. start dealing with the emotional ranges, whatever. I completely agree with you because Man. sometimes young actors... I always say to my students, don't think about your character. No. Just find out all the information that are said in your script. You know. And then you work on your character. Otherwise, you, you, the, the risk is that you put too much things before you really understand what you're doing. Yeah, understanding the story is first. Yeah. You know, uh, you know we have the six questions. You know, what, where, why, how, when, how. You know, yeah. Who, you know, that kind of thing. And then we have a different methods that we deal with with the script analysis here. Um, to, to arrive to a point where naturally ideas start to come to you yeah. and your visualizations start to come to you and then all of a sudden you start, without realizing it, you start developing a character. You are feeding. Yeah. Feeding your you character know. with all the information, with all your imaginary reality because imagination. An actor must believe that this is not a studio, but this is a, a wood, for instance, you know? Yeah, Especially yeah. when you are on, on yeah. theater, you have full scenery. Yeah. But on camera, of course, you have all the te technicians around, all the things around, but you have a, a lot of concentration and a lot of imagination, I think. Well, yeah, and that's, that's a problem for a film actor as well. When they come on set, they, you, know, you have a production assistant, you've got a <laughs> script, script uh, continuity girl, you got makeup, you got A hair. big mess, most of the you, time. You, 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 you have a casino. And uh, so then how does the actor uh, learn the discipline yeah. to sit there and go, okay, fine, now we're ready to go. Yeah. If we were here doing a scene now, we're yeah. ready to go. Yeah. You know, and I don't care about the yeah. director. I don't care about the cameraman. I, I'm very aware of the camera, of course, because that's who I'm working for. You know, I'm working for the camera. I'm working for the editor. Uh, if, you you know, that, me yeah. the, if you pass me the word... <laughs> Actor is like a schizophrenic, but lucid, <laughs> lucid schizophrenic. He's aware that he's doing his job in front of everyone, but on the other hand, he creates his own reality. Yeah, well, you know, it's, it's, just, it's, it's, it's an amazing process. You know, you've done a lot of work, you know, and we'll see some clips here yeah. uh, pretty soon. Yeah. And, um, you know, you're a fine actor, very, very good. Thank actor. you. I, I know a lot of actors in Italy, and you are very special. Well, I, I think that, uh, you know, I just go uh, for, for, I mean, the, the, an actor, in my, on my points, enjoys when he founds, starting from himself, to transform in another character. It's like living another life. This is the yeah. most enjoyable part for me. Yeah. I mean, being, being on, on, a, on a screen, sometimes at the beginning at least, it's a, a bit like uh, you don't like yourself, you don't like this and that. But then you, you, you start to, have to make friends yeah. with yourself okay. Okay. and to start you know, to think about to create the character, to create emotions, to create real uh, relationship with your partners. 
Se non sono indiscreto, quanto servirebbe? <ride> Una cifra vicina a mille. Mille? Mille miliardi di lire. Ma la follia provocherà un voragine nei nostri conti. Se si scuota la Polonia, sarà un terremoto per tutti i paesi dell'est. This is the key point, I think, to create a real yeah. relationship with your partners. I'm, I'm working with a script now that I have to shoot a film in April. And this character that I'm playing is completely different than me. Mm. He's older. Wow. His physical condition is not good. Um, so those are the things I'm thinking about. How's his body? How's mm -hmm. his voice? Because then the voice has changed as mm -hmm. well, because your body's changed. Yeah. What are your movements like? This um, is a psychological approach you know, to life. What is, what is, you know, what is your focus? What is your, you know, okay. Objective is a very cliche word, but it is important. And when I'm working with a young boy in, the, in this particular thing, you know, what, you know, there's just something that arrives that once you study, 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 and you're doing your script analysis, you're asking yourself the questions, you know, the story, and then you start to visualize, then, you know, I always close my eyes and visualize myself working. And then something magical arrives and then it becomes that reality, you know, and you're not self-conscious, you know, no. I, I don't no. care what I look like. No, you know, I really don't. Yeah, this uh, is another good point that sometimes yeah. Talking about our <laughs> students, you know, they come, they may be beautiful women or yeah, beautiful yeah. boys and it's not enough. To be beautiful is just a part of the job, maybe yeah, because it's, you an know. it's an advantage. Yeah, it's an advantage. But if you no. don't have the tools, if yeah. you don't have the relationship no. skills, it doesn't work. Then, then you have no. a model on camera that is, you know, really disturbing. Yeah, you know, it's very disturbing to watch. Uh, it's very distracting in a way because they're very, they're very self-aware, and this is something we can't be. You know, we just. We just can't be that way. Yeah, I like to quote a Strasberg, a Strasberg uh, sentence that he said, an actor must be private in public. Mm. That it's like uh, um, the audience must be like a wire that look a, a piece of a life of somebody. And that's exactly right, because you're, you know, the, 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 the audience, whether you're film or theater, They are voyeurs, yeah. you know, they're like a child. They're like a yeah. curious child. So what are, you, what, are you, what are you giving the audience, you know, when they're watching you? Because they get to see you. They get to see this life taking place and they're curious, you know, yes. what is it that you're going to bring to them? Um, I always try to say to my, my actors, I don't like to say words, students, I always use... Uh, yeah, actors. okay. But... Um, yes, good point. Um, <laughs> yeah, I just do. Um, you know, you, you, you want to bring your audience to you. You don't want to go to the audience. Mm -hmm. You know, you yeah. don't want to present. You don't want to indicate, as you say. Um, uh, you, you want to create this thing that is, just comes over you that you have no idea what you're doing. A lot of times I, I don't know what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. You know, I've had directors say, what are you going to do? And I said, I don't know. Yeah. Because if something It's like in life now, we are not, we don't know what we are saying or doing. No, not really. It just really. comes yeah. because I'm listening to you, you're listening yeah. to me. Absolutely. And we are logical and we are listening and so we are creating life. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know, so, you It's know. It's the same process in a way. <laughs> well, you know, I've had things where, you know, things have dropped. Yeah. You know, yeah. or something has happened that wasn't yeah. in the script, but your discipline, you play through it. We say, yeah. we play through it. Unless the director says, cut, you continue. Because maybe the director said, wow, I love that. Yeah, because you know, that, that, that is know. so fresh, because so it was just strong. something that happened. Yeah. And so the actor's job, definitely, you do yes. not cut yourself. You know, I've had a lot of actors when we shoot, we shoot a lot of scenes here and We shoot a lot and you know this oh sorry uh cut hold it excuse me i'm the director here i'm the one that says cut 